Monitor Video Chapter 3 During the Day Responsibilities for the Monitor The team leader will give you the supplies you will need for the day. This will include screen cleaning items, a card collection box, magnifiers, I voted stickers, black tape, and voting instructions. As the monitor, you will direct the voter to an available voting machine. You must ask each voter if they know how to use a touchscreen voting machine. When the voting machine is available, the LED light will be green. If a voter is at the voting machine voting, the LED light will be red. If the LED light is flashing red and you notice the voter walking away, this indicates that the voter did not complete their vote and pulled the card out too soon. Ask the voter to go back to the voting machine, reinsert their card, and they can start their voting over. A flashing red light may also indicate an error on the voting machine. In that case, you would call the team leader. Monitors must stand at the back of the voting machines when assisting the voter. You may not go to the front of the voting machine. If the light is flashing red and the voter has already left, call the team leader. If the voter does not know how to use the voting machine, you may use your voting instructions to assist them from the back. It is extremely important that the monitor is standing and aware of what is going on at the voting machines while voters are present. Monitors will be rotated throughout the day to collect cards and give out I Voted stickers. This gives everyone the opportunity to sit down for a while. We will now review the voting process on the ICX voting machine. Insert the card arrow up into the yellow slot. Select the preferred language. You will see a title page. Touch next at the bottom right of the screen to go to the first page of the ballot. To make a selection, touch the square next to the name of your choice. A check mark will appear. Touch next at the bottom right of the screen to navigate through the pages of the ballot. You may also touch Previous to go back a page. To make a change, touch the same square again and the check mark will disappear. Now choose the selection you desire. You are not required to vote in all of the races. At any point in the ballot, you may touch the Review button at the bottom left of the screen to go to the Review screen. However, at the end of the ballot, you will automatically be taken to the Review screen. A message may appear at the top letting you know that you have not made all of your selections. Remember, you do not have to make all of the selections. Use the scroll down and scroll up to view all the races on the review screen. If you want to make a change, touch the appropriate race on the review screen and you will be taken back to that page of the ballot. Now navigate to the end of the ballot by touching Next until you come back to the review screen. If you are satisfied with your selections, touch the Print Ballot for Review button at the bottom right of the screen. Now touch Print Ballot for Review once again when the pop-up box comes up. The ballot will now be printed. The voter cannot take the printout. It is only for auditing purposes. If the ballot is too long to fit on one page, you will see another pop-up. Touch Print Next Page. The next page will print. You may now either touch Cast Ballot to record vote or you may touch Make Changes. 
Make Changes will take you back to the review screen and the printout will show Ballot is Rejected. You may then go to the contest you wish to change by touching that contest. If you are satisfied with your selections, touch the button that says Cast Ballot to Record Vote. Remove the vote card when you see the message at the bottom of the screen which says thank you for voting. Please remove vote card and return to an election official. We will now review the toolbar at the top of the ICX screen. You may change the language at any time during the ballot by touching the small flag icon on the toolbar. You may change the text size on the ballot by touching the icon on the toolbar with the double A's. You may change the contrast by touching the view icon on the toolbar. Call the team leader for any of the following situations. The LED light is flashing red and the voter is not present. The voter requests assistance at the voting machine. The voter has questions about the ballot, his precinct, or party. The voter says the card was incorrectly activated. The voter needs a translator. Media is present. Observers are trying to talk to you. Electioneering or campaigning is happening inside the polling place. If a voter is using his phone to talk or take pictures while voting. This completes Chapter 3.